I will show them now. Okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm here, I'm here. John chapter 16, verse 7. Wait here. John chapter 16, verse 7. Jesus said, after he ascended to the heaven, he said, the spirit of the truth will come and guide you. So the spirit of the truth is the way. The spirit of the truth is the way. The spirit of the truth is the way. Here, but very truly, I tell you, if you're not good, that I'm going away, unless I go away, the advocate will not come to you. But if I I will go, I will send him to you. So now, according to the another verse, Jesus said, I will ask the Father to send the spirit of the truth. So the spirit of the truth, his work is to guide people to wa the way to the God. Was Muhammad. So all prophets, uh, Jesus yes, prophet Muhammad. Muhammad. Yes. Oh my God. So, so Jesus said Muhammad. The way Muhammad. Muhammad. and the truth uh, is Jesus prophet Muhammad. Muhammad. Jesus, Jesus said Muhammad. He said the You're way, the, the spirit of the truth is prophet Muhammad. Isaiah chapter 29 verse 12. The Muhammad. book will be given. The book will be given. What is the spirit of truth? Jibrail or The book will be given to the illiterate one. And he will be asked to read, and he will say, I do not know how to read. Is Who is that written in Isaiah? Chapter 29, truth? verse 12. Who That's Prophet Muhammad. Truth? Jesus was the only the way truth? his time on earth Who to his people, Israelites. Truth? That's why he said, I was only truth? sent to the Siraj, lost who sheep is the spirit of Israel. Of truth? Only who is only. Is the spirit of and he is said, Muhammad do not go where Samaritans and Gentiles are. But the Quran says, you said, According to the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 10, verse 5 to 6, Jesus said to Israelites, his disciples, do not go where Gentiles and Samaritans are. So Jesus was only the way for his, to his, for his people. Moses was the way and the truth to the God. Same as Jesus. Said, go and Jesus to is all a the prophet. Nations. Jesus is and a prophet. He, left, he said, go to all the nations. Now, Jesus yeah. said, do not go where said, Samaritans go and Gentiles the nations, are. Baptize them in now, the name of the Father, now, Son, no. and the Holy Spirit. Was yeah. Jesus baptized in the name of God, the, the, the Son, and the Holy Spirit? Was Jesus, Jesus said, I have only sent to the lost sheep of Israel. Why is the only? Why is the only? Why is the only? You are a slave. You are a slave of God. According to Romans chapter 22, verse 6. Stop misquoting, Siraj. Stop misquoting. Come, let's go. Every time he denies his verses, he stop misquoting. Let me, is Prophet Muhammad, yes. According to us. Isaiah, yes, chap Muhammad, no. the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, he said I'm going to refute him. I'm going to refute him. Wait, brother, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. You want time? Please, time for us. I will teach him a lesson today. Time for us. Talk two minutes. No. Two minutes, bro. Okay. Time for him. No, time for him. Wait. I'm going to teach his Bible today, this guy. He, yeah, he's going to teach us who the spirit of truth is in, the, Hold on. in Islam. Is it Jibrael? Because time, two saying, minutes, talk. Two minutes, two minutes, let him talk, yeah, two minutes. Two minutes, time, time for us. Yeah, talk, talk. So, in Islam, Watch out. the spirit of truth is supposed to be Jibrael, which is not supported by the scripture, but that's what they claim their scripture says. However, they is also claim that in John, when Jesus is talking about, I'll send you a helper, which is the Holy Spirit, is also, uh, the Holy Spirit is also Muhammad. So is the Holy Spirit supposed to be Muhammad or is it, because he's the, he said, I'll send you this, the, the, spirit, the spirit of truth. So which is the spirit two of minutes, truth? Yeah. Is it Muhammad two or yeah, is it minutes. Jibrail? I'm done. Yeah, is it Muhammad? Yes, okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. okay. Who's a, in your, in yeah. Islam, okay. Okay. Yeah. what is the spirit of truth? Is okay. it Jibrail or is it uh, the this, one that from John? The context from John is Prophet Muhammad is not Angel Jibril. Angel Jibril was not a prophet. What are you talking about? It doesn't say prophet plus, anyways. Plus, let me no. answer. Two minutes. Okay. Two minutes. Two minutes. Okay. Now, start for me two minutes. That, that was for him. Start for me. So now... Yeah, two minutes, no, no, yeah? No. Stop it. Yeah, he started. Zero. Zero. Two minutes, yeah. Two minutes. Yeah, started again. Yeah. Okay. So now, let me come to the point. He said the spirit of the truth is the Holy Spirit. That can never be. Christians always lie about this verse. John chapter 16, verse 7. They say the, Holy, the spirit of the truth in this verse is, is the Holy Spirit. It's not Prophet Muhammad. 
So Jesus said in order the spirit of the truth to come, he said, I will not be there. So this Holy Spirit was there Jesus time. And the condition of the spirit of the truth to come is what? Jesus to ascend to the heaven. That's what Jesus said what? The spirit of the truth will not come unless I go. If he goes, what happens? The spirit of the truth will come. So my question to Christians, if Jesus said the spirit of the truth will not come unless I go, how can that be the Holy Spirit? Because the Holy Spirit was there Jesus' time with him. That's what Jesus said. What? According to example, according to the Gospel of Luke, chapter 24, verse 49, Jesus said what? To his disciples, wait here. Wait, 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 wait. wait. No, don't, don't, don't go back. Jesus said what? Wait, wait for me here. The Spirit of the Holy Spirit will come and fill you the power of God. So the Holy Spirit was there Jesus' time. So this Spirit of Truth cannot be the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit was already there Jesus' time. So I'm asking Christians, the, the Spirit of the Truth cannot be the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit and Jesus were there same time. And Jesus said, the Spirit of the Truth will come unless I go. So in order the spirit of the truth to come, Jesus must go and then the spirit of the truth will come. So how can that be the Holy Spirit? Who is that spirit of the truth? It's not the Holy Spirit. According to the, John chapter 16, for, verse 7. Brother, yes. Brother, you're talking with rubbish okay, while he's drunk and okay. before he's no, drunk. Is no, no problem. Man. No, no. No, now he's, he's no, now no, he's talk. No problem. Don't now, no, rubbish. talk. Ignore him. Ignore him. Shut up. Okay. Okay, talk now. Two minutes, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so two minutes? Yes. Do you answer my question? I'm going to answer if question? you allow me to okay. answer, okay? And don't interrupt. Okay, I don't, I'm not interrupting. Because I didn't interrupt you. Okay. All right? Okay. okay so He's yeah. not going to interrupt. I didn't interrupt him. Yeah, I'm not. So I'll have two minutes now. Okay. The spirit of the truth, Jesus said, when I leave, because when he was with them, they had the, the you know, he's got the son. So he said, when I'm leaving, I won't leave you alone, like my, yourself. Nobody to help you. I'll send you a helper, which is the spirit of truth which is the Holy Spirit. And unless I leave, it will, I, because he has to leave to send the Holy Spirit to them, because as long as he's with them, they don't need the Holy Spirit at that time because he's with them. When he said that I leave, I won't leave you alone. I will send you a helper. And that will remind you of all the things that I've said to you, and I will guide you. That's what the Holy, the Holy Spirit does. So, and then he told them where to go when they will receive it. When they Spectrum. go to Galilee and you will receive the Holy Spirit. Before that, when they received the Holy Spirit, they were timid. They were afraid of going out and preaching the gospel. And after they received the Holy Spirit, they were bold. They went out, they did not care about anything about their lives or anything like that. Because they were filled with the Spirit of God, which is the Spirit of Truth. Now the Spirit of Truth, I asked him, in the Quran, is mentioned that when Muhammad was in the cave, the Spirit of Truth came to him. And I said, the Spirit of Truth in the Bible is the Holy Spirit. Which Spirit is I? When I asked another Muslim, they said, he's Jibreel. And now he's saying that, no, no, no. Jesus is saying that he's going to send Muhammad. So is, is what Jesus said, did Jesus, when Muhammad came, did he say, Jesus sent me? Who did, he said, God sent me. That means that God is Jesus? Because Jesus is saying, I will send them. So you guys have a problem because you guys quote this verse for reference of Muhammad in the Quran. I mean, in the Bible, sorry. That's a 13 seconds, I'll give it to him. Now, he didn't answer my question. My question to him was, wait. My question to him was, the Holy Spirit was there with Jesus and his disciples. But he said, Jesus and the Holy Spirit, the disciples never needed the Holy Spirit by the time of Jesus. But the Holy Spirit and Jesus were there at the same time. So Jesus said, the Spirit of the truth will not come unless I go. And the Holy Spirit was there with Jesus. So I'm asking Christians, who is the Spirit of the truth? Because that cannot be the Holy Spirit. In order the Spirit of the truth to come, Jesus said, I will go unless if I don't go, the, Holy, the spirit of the truth will not come. So who is that the spirit of the truth? That cannot be the Holy Spirit. Is I'm that, asking. Okay, wait. So now he said, some Muslims said what? He said, Jesus said, I will send the, the spirit of the truth. It's not Jesus sending. According to the John, same book, 
Jesus said, I will ask the Father to send the Spirit. He's asking who? The Father. Who's the Father? God. It's not Jesus sent it. Jesus himself was sent by God. That's why in the Gospel of John, chapter 17, verse 5, Jesus said what? When he was talking to God, he said, Oh, Father, you're the only true God. And I am who you sent. Who sent Jesus? God the Father. God. And Jesus said what? I will ask God the Father to send the Spirit of the truth. So Jesus got nothing to do with that. And guess what? Jesus has no authority to send anyone. So and he said the Spirit of the truth. He said some Muslims said his angel Jibril. No, there is no Muslim says the Spirit of the truth in this verse is angel Jibril. Empty words. No, now I want you to tell me who is the Spirit of the truth that should come after Jesus and that spirit of the truth, according to this verse, is the way and to the way to God. Jesus was only the way to God, his time on earth. After he left, he said, the spirit of the truth will guide you the way to God. It's finished. Okay, you finished? Yes. Please, don't, don't interrupt, please, yeah? Please, yeah, brother. Okay, I, got I want him time? to speak. Okay, great. Two minutes. All right, now, I will quote you the words. Anybody listening here can go on the Google Go to BibleTheHub.com or Bible on the Gateway and look at the verse. It's John 16, verse 7. Nevertheless, I tell you the truth. It is expedient for you and I, uh, that I go away. For if I go not away, the Comforter will not come unto you. But if I depart, I will send him on to you. I will send him on to you. That's Don't the word. Speak. Don't worry. Anybody Don't can read it. Don't speak. Anybody can Don't read no. it. Carry on. Carry he on. said, I will send him to you. He just misquotes. He, all he does is misquotes the Bible for the Muslims. And they go, yeah, 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 yeah. But how many really? versions are there? Wait, wait. Please wait. Please wait, okay. brother. He, 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 the, he took it from this word. He said, this verse says this. That he, I will ask the Father to send you the helper. That's what he said. And the verse says, I will send you. It's written right there. Okay? That's the kind of debate that we are having. Where my friend here has to resort to this level of deception. That's Islam. That's how they can prove that Jesus didn't send the helper. Allah sent the helper. It says right there, I will send the helper. I'm done. Are you done? He used one verse, John chapter 16, verse 7, yeah? Here, John chapter 14, verse 16. Jesus said, and I will ask the Father. He will ask the Father what? To send who? Why if Jesus want, could send the spirit of the truth, why would he ask the Father? That means he's less. He has no power. Can God ask anyone permission? Can, yes, same book as him. He said, I will ask the Father so he can send the Holy Spirit. So now I'm asking. So, so now I'm asking. Jesus is less compared to God. Why? Because God of the Bible said what in the, in, in the, gospel, in the Old Testament. Exodus chapter 15 verse 18. It says, God the Father will reign forever. Forever means what? Is it temporary? Or after some time? No. Is it for? lifetime so how can jesus send half authority no there's nowhere there's no chance also even jesus according to christians they said jesus was given all authority but after he claimed he was given all authority jesus could go to heaven by himself guess what it says in the gospel of luke chapter 24 verse 51 he was taken to heaven if jesus was given all authority why he needed someone else to take him to the heaven? Where is the power? See, it doesn't make, it doesn't add up. So now what I'm asking, who is the spirit of the truth? Again, I'm repeating until now he's not answering. They said he's not Prophet Muhammad. Okay, for the sake of argument, if the spirit of the truth is not Prophet Muhammad, as Christians claim here, so who is that the spirit of the truth? That can never be the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit was there Jesus' time, was there disciples' time. So who is that the spirit of the truth? Christians, they said we have the Holy Spirit was guided, uh, the Holy Spirit guided us. That's if the Holy Spirit guided you, who is the spirit of the truth? Okay. Tell us. Right. Now, Until now. He don't know, he don't know. Yes, he doesn't right. know. So you got two minutes? Okay. Yeah, two minutes. So he quoted another verse where it says, 
God uh, will ask the Father, He will send the Holy Spirit, right? The Spirit, and I quoted, the uh, Comforter. Okay, and I said that, in the other words, He said, I will send it. The, when uh, Jesus said that, I will resurrect this temple, if you destroy this temple, He was talking about His body. I will resurrect my body. In another words, it says the Holy Spirit will resurrect His body. In another words, it says the Father will resurrect His body. Three of them are one. That is why when he uses the Father himself, he's talking and in several verses, he, okay, I'll quote you one verse to show you. He said, what is his authority? Can God call a man God? Can God call a man God? In Hebrews, I think you missed this chapter. In oh. Hebrews, uh, chapter 1, verse 8. Uh, but unto the Son, he said, this is the Father speaking. But unto the Son, he said, Thy throne, O God, is forever and ever. A scepter of righteousness is the scepter of thy kingdom. Number nine, thou hast loved righteousness and hated iniquity. Therefore, God, even thy God, hath anointed thee with the oil of gladness above, and thy, above thy fellows. This is God speaking about Jesus. He is calling Jesus God. That is wait, Hebrews wait. 1. That's not What's Jesus it? talking. It's Paul talking. He, he's he not is, lying. This is, he's he, lying. This is God, that's not Jesus talking. talking. No, God talking. He is talking. No, that's not Father God. Father is talking. Yeah. He said Let him finish. Okay, two minutes. Let him finish. Two I'm going to get my 30 seconds back. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Stop yeah. Yeah. Give him. Okay. No, put Give him. Brother, wait. All right. Wait. Okay. Go Don't on, do that, speak, Siraj, speak. I didn't do it to you. Okay, sorry, sorry. You speak. said a lot of stuff, I could have come okay, in. Go Give on. me 30 seconds back. Give him 30 second, okay. seconds. Okay, now Give I've shown you the Listen. authority of Jesus. He is God because in he, he has died. said in several, I can show you other, I don't have time right died. now. I can show you another verse. If you go to, um, it's chapter uh, 17 of, uh, I believe it's John 17, where Jesus is praying. And he's talking to God and he's saying to God, you and I are one and I am in you and you are in me. And he's saying us, us is something that only two people who are together say. So he has said that. Yeah, that my time is up. Okay. okay, now again, he changed the topic, talking about whether Jesus is God or not. And the topic was, who is the spirit of the truth where Jesus quoted in the Gospel of John chapter 16 verse 7. Christians always say we have the Holy Spirit to understand the Bible. Yeah. If they have the Holy Spirit to understand the Bible, why can they not tell us who is the Spirit of the truth? Because the Sp Holy Spirit was there Jesus' time. So now I'm changing the topic because he changed that okay, topic gonna, to topic. talk I'm about topic. whether Jesus change, is God or not. Go to any other topic. So now we have one topic. Okay, wait, 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 wait. This that topic, topic is finished. No, no, now. I'm not going to talk. No, about you talked about finished, God of God. Jesus okay. is God. You right. changed the topic. No, 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 I didn't. You just said I, no, Jesus no, no. and you God are the Father. You said where is his authority. I showed you his no. authority. He is okay. God. That's his authority. Wait. I already answered your first question about Holy Spirit. Can you give me? You didn't okay. answer. Okay. Until now, you didn't stop tell me who is the Spirit the of the okay, truth. Stop the time. Listen, listen. Okay. I already told you that the Holy Spirit, every Christian knows that when he's talking about the Comforter, he's talking about the Holy Spirit. He's, that can never be the Holy Spirit according okay. to the, to the so context. If, if you say, Jesus said the Spirit of the truth. I'm repeating. Yeah. He said the Spirit of the truth will not come unless I go. And I answered that so too. how can okay, this you don't Holy understand. Spirit wait wait I already answered um, that. let me finish I didn't finish. Jesus said how the Holy Spirit, the spirit of the truth will not come unless what? I go. What's the condition the spirit of the truth to come? Jesus to go and then who comes first? next? And who will send him? Who comes next? The spirit of the truth will come. Okay now if the spirit of the truth comes when the Jesus is not there. Okay, do you want to How, continue wait, the debate? Wait, I'm carrying on. I'm carrying no, on. Carrying on so who is the spirit okay. of the truth? You, because that can okay. never be the are Holy Spirit. The, yeah. okay. the Holy Spirit was Listen, already there with Jesus. Again? Are you going to time okay. it again? Now, time it for me. Do you, you want to continue yes. with this yes. one? Because I don't want to change time the topic. Us. Yes, time for us. I'm just having this debate. I need my time because you talked interrupted No, no, no. You can go ahead and have your time back. Yeah, uh, I will need one more minute because one he talked, yeah, interrupted one minute, me. One minute. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. No, this time, that time no, and no, another no, time, okay. one minute. Yeah, one minute, yeah. I'll give you the two minutes. Okay, so now he quoted about where saying Jesus was, uh, was given authority. He lied about Hebrews. Hebrews is not to God talking, it's Paul talking. And Paul is the one who said what? He's the one who approved people to lie about Jesus. He said, 
according to Philippians chapter 1 verse 18, he said, what does it matter? If seen some people lying, preaching about Jesus. And Paul said, what does it matter to lie about Jesus? And he said, You're the most, the I'm coming to You're that point. The, the most important thing is what? To, whether from false motives, false motives, or true motives, Christ must be preached. Christ must be preached in two ways, from false motives or true okay, motives. Are we talking about okay, are we talking so about now, Paul? the spirit of the truth, what are the we spirit of the truth. <laughs> wait, 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 no, he's not talking about wait. The, Holy spirit. He's the about spirit of the truth there cannot be the Holy Spirit. Do you know why? Because the Bible says, according to Jesus, it's Jesus said the spirit of the truth. If it is the Holy, the Holy Spirit, Jesus said it shall not speak. He shall not speak by his own. So if the Holy Spirit is God, and Jesus said what? The Holy Spirit shall not speak by his own, but shall speak what? What God commands. Can God receive command? Can God receive a command from our others? No. So how can that be the Holy Spirit? It says it shall, he shall not, he shall not speak of his own. So who is giving order? God. So how can the Holy Spirit be God then? Jesus as well. Jesus said, Father himself, the Father, God the Father, himself, Jesus himself, and the, his disciples, all of them are one. According to Christians, only they use what verses suit them. Like Jesus said, I and Father one. Also he said what, in one, no, in one God is one purpose same as john chapter 21 verse 17 jesus said god the father the son himself and the, his disciples all of them are one and jesus said what well, you cannot call anyone father on this earth and jesus where was when he was saying that on this earth and he said what well, do not call anyone father on this earth for you have only okay, one father no the extra on. minute no he, de he didn't give me that extra minute Minutes, but I'll just so speak now. Minutes, okay. okay. You got like 10 seconds. Finish it up. Okay, I'll just finish this one. Okay, Jesus said, do not call anyone father on this earth. And Jesus, when he was saying that he was on this planet, on this earth, he said, for you have only one father and he is in heaven. Okay, According to Matthew enough. chapter 23, okay, verse 9. Oh, All, right. All right, now. Let's talk about the Holy Spirit. I don't know where he's going with the Father and then Paul and all kinds of other stuff. You're that talking about the Holy Spirit and uh, that Jesus sent the Holy Spirit. is not so uh, the prophet. The Holy Spirit, the Father, and uh, the Holy Spirit are no, one, right? I'll come to that point. So if he talks about one of them, wouldn't that be talking about all of them? Yes, even the disciples, okay, let, let all according to them, they are one. Because even yeah. Jesus lives in the disciples and God. Right. So that they so, must be so God then, also. Okay, you're taking up my time. Okay. Can you pull up Give him two minutes now. Give me two minutes now. Two minutes, yeah? And, and he didn't please start don't interrupt. He didn't start yet. No, he didn't start it. No, yeah, no. Didn't, two minutes. Okay. Now, I'm going to give you two minutes here. Like, he, Can I sky the water? We're going back to John 16. And, uh, I'll sky the water. About number 13. Thank you. John 16, 13. It says, How about when he, the spirit of truth is come, he will guide you unto all truth, for he shall not speak of himself, but whatsoever he shall hear, that shall he speak, and he will shew you things to come. He shall glorify me, for he shall receive of mine, and shall shew it unto you. Now, all things uh, the Father had are mine and ours. So if Jesus and they all have one, uh, one uh, will, the Spirit, the Father, and the Son. So they're saying all of us comes from us, meaning whatever I'm going to say, that's what coming from the Spirit. So because of because the disciples at this time only know Jesus and the Father, so he's telling him them about the Spirit, saying that I'm going to send you the Holy Spirit. Then when he sends the Holy Spirit, he tells them to go and receive the Holy Spirit in Galilee. And when they go and receive the Holy Spirit, they start speaking in languages and they start doing stuff that nobody knew they could do. That was when they received the Holy Spirit. Now, I've answered this question 10 times that the Holy Spirit is the, uh, the, the Spirit of Truth is the Holy Spirit. Now I'm going to answer his other question because he keeps saying that, um, you know, Islamic claim is that Muhammad is this Holy Spirit. Because this Holy Spirit, is going to show us about Jesus. He's going to guide us about Jesus. Did Muhammad come and do that? Or was he sent by Jesus? That's what he doesn't want to answer because that's what his claim is. Because the whole debate about this about is, this is about 
it's not Muhammad, it is the Holy Spirit that he sent to his disciples and that the Muslims, the Christians believe. He's changing the whole topic into something else. And I want him to answer, where, how can you show that this Holy Spirit that is glorifying Jesus is, uh, is Muhammad? How can that be? Is okay. It not, is it not? Yes. Okay. okay. So now he, Jesus said what? When the Spirit of the truth will glorify me. So now I want any single verse where the Holy Spirit glorified Jesus in the Bible. Jesus said what? The Spirit of the truth, when it comes, what? He will glorify me. So is there any single verse now we can find from the New Testament where the Holy Spirit glorified Jesus? No, there's nowhere. Prophet Muhammad glorified and talked about positive about Jesus in many verses of, in the Quran. He mentioned 25 times Jesus' name. <laughs> Prophet Adam, same. He was mentioned 25 times. But Christians always say Prophet Jesus is more than Prophet Muhammad. Why? Because he was mentioned 25 times than Prophet Muhammad in the Quran. That cannot show anything because Adam was mentioned 25 times as well in the Quran. So now Prophet Muhammad told us, let's compare. The Bible never glorified Jesus. You know why? Jesus in the Bible, he was a racist man. He was a racist man. In the Quran, Jesus was never like that. Jesus, yeah, he called Gentiles dogs and swine. And he said he ignored them. Do not go where Gentiles and Samaritans are. So now my question is, I'm asking, Jesus in the Bible, he says he was a sinner. He was a liar, false prophet. I can give you many verses. In the Bible, Jesus was given false messages. God of the Bible said, if a prophet is given a false message, he said, I, the Lord, deceived that prophet. According to Ezekiel chapter 14, verse 9. And Jesus, do you know what he said? In the Gospel of John chapter 16, verse 32, Jesus said, there will be a time you will run away from me and the Father will be there with That's me. It. But according to Mark chapter... 15 verse 34 all his disciples ran away and he said my father why have you forsaken from me so he lied he was given false messages okay start again all right now this shows that siraj has admitted that he's lost the debate because he's now attacking all kinds of other stuff except for proving the holy spirit is not muhammad that or is muhammad that is the debate now you can see he's going here, there, everywhere. And That's the end, end resort. When you lose the debate, you change the topic, you get a red herring, or you just talk about all the different things. That, uh, to, yeah, he's jumping because now he cannot prove that that spirit of truth is Muhammad. And I told him that spirit of, and the Bible is full of glorifying Jesus in the Old Testament, in the New. I just showed him in Hebrews, God is calling Jesus God. That's how much the, the Bible or the, you know, is, is glorifying Jesus. He's coming up with his own stuff. All right, Siraj, I think we are done with this debate. Thank you for your time. Okay, wait. I'm finished. No, I will talk. I'm finished now. Wait, he's running. Wait, it's, no, I'm not running. It's, it's over. Wait, wait. He's running. Which Aramaic Bible? Yeah. Well, which verse do you want me to read? From 7. And again, Yeshua. No, he's with you. He's with you. Yeah. Timeless truth I speak unto you. I am the living God. Yeah. The gate of no, wait, God. Wait, wait. And He's all with you. who had come were thieves and robbers. But the flock did not hear them. I am the living God. Yeah. The gate. Yeah. Okay, wait. This is the Aramaic Bible. This is the Aramaic Come here. Aramaic Come here. Is that Aramaic? Yeah. Is that Aramaic? Yeah. Aramaic okay, what is that about the other? Others are wrong. Why others are not the same? Jesus is God. No, I'm asking. Is that English? No, is that English or not English? Is the other one English? Okay, now. So now he said, Jesus. Wait, listen. Listen to your friend. Listen to your friend. He said, he, I changed the topic, yes? He said to me, show me where Prophet Muhammad glorified Jesus, yes? And I give him the answer. Show, but he said, I changed the topic. So now, he's making up how can hearing. the Bible Another glorify red Jesus? Red when red God red of the red Bible red said, red I will not share red my red glory red with red anyone. I'm According to Isaiah chapter 42, red verse red 8. And he I'm said, God will win forever. Exodus chapter 15, verse 18. So now, yeah, I, I, I'm done. Come here, please. Do you know English? 
Can you use your logic? You showed me one verse, the other verse, same English translation. One says, I'm the living God, and the other one says something else. Why is the other one wrong? Wait, come, come here. Come. Is that Aramaic? Where is the Aramaic language? Show me where it says that. Come, use your logic. Please come. So don't use. Do not use. No, do not use. Look, King James Version. King James Version is the most approved one out of all those you showed me. Where is the Aramaic language? You come here. Please come here. Come here. Come here. But the translation, oh, I will not show your face. But I want you to tell me why King James Version, International Version, and, and, and what is in and King James, all others, are not saying I'm the... So which one is the correct? Is that one wrong then? Is that one wrong? Use your logic, come on. Away did Jesus claim divinity, tell me. Away did he claim divinity? Jesus Christ speak Aramaic. No, Aramaic. no, that's not Aramaic. Is that Aramaic or English? Aramaic. No, is that Aramaic language? Yes. No, is that Aramaic language? Says, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Okay, wait, sorry. It uh -huh. says direct translation uh -huh. Aramaic, Aramaic into plain, English. Plain English. English. And the other one is not English? Is the other one not plain, plain English? English? Okay, is the other one not plain English? Do you understand what I'm no, saying? No, I'm asking. Is the you other one not plain English? Saying. Okay. What verse is that? Okay, what verse is that? Tell me. John what? 7? John 7. John 10, 7. John 10, 7. Watch out, Christians here. I don't get these people, man. What manuscript is this? John 7. What manuscript? What manuscript do you have in Aramaic? Wait, wait, wait. Here. Look. John 7, 10. Oh, 10, 7. Okay, wait. Come, I'll show you how they lie about the translation. Look here. John 10, verse 7, yeah? New international version. International version, yeah? Not Aramaic. Is this English? Wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Brother, let me come to the point. Is English different? Is the English different? Is this no plain English? It says plain English. Okay, is this plain English? Plain What's English. the plain? What's the meaning of plain? It's straight, direct. Okay, what is this then? Is this not direct? It doesn't say plain. It what is this then? Is this direct or fake then? So you know that they're lying then? You just admit it. Look here. Therefore, Jesus said again, very truly, I tell you, I am the gate for the sheep. Look, lying. Look here. The verse is different, lying. Again, New Living International. Look, use your logic. They're playing with your mind. So he explained to them, I tell you the truth, I am the gate for the sheep. Okay. Gent and, and Israel Israelites. Because all prophets were the way and the truth for their people to God. Not just Jesus. And Jesus, when he ascended, he was not the way. Prophet Muhammad was the way. That's why he said, the spirit of the truth will come and so guide you. You're telling me Muhammad was the spirit, yeah? The spirit of the truth. He was the spirit of the truth. Yes. Muhammad. Yes. He wasn't a human. Do you know? Do you know? He do you know? The, Jesus, he said, he will use. Is the spirit he? Is the spirit he? No. He is for human. No, spirit he is for human. Why not? Spirit cannot. Is human. Tell me then. Is the spirit human? Jesus said, he will guide you. He shall not speak by his own. Okay, who, so, can the Holy Spirit... Uh, can you so, that verse, uh, so now, look here. Again, English is standard version. English, direct, plain English. English standard version. He said, so Jesus again, said to them, truly, truly, I say to you, I'm the door for the sheep. So now, King James version, same. New King James version, same. But here, Aramaic Bible, in plain English. Look now here. American Standard Version, Jesus said, therefore, said unto them again, ver verily, verily, I say unto you, I'm the door for the sheep. And now again here, Aramaic Bible. English is the same English, but different versions. Come, let me show you now how they play with you, mine. Do you know 1 John chapter 5, verse 7? Can you go for me, please? 
John 1 John 5 7. Do you know it's only found in King James Version, but other versions are not, is not there. Why is that? Tell me. Who inspired the rest? Tell me, please. My brother. 